Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel where we talk about wellness, health, fitness for the athlete over 40. So today, I just wanted to start off with sharing what I have for breakfast. Even though I'm not prepping for this competition per se, but I'm still sticking with the breakfast plan. And I wanted to share with you what that was. So you see, I got a couple boiled eggs here. Um, I normally have like eight or 10 just so that I have everything all set. So I will grab two boiled eggs and I'll eat the whole egg. And I get the eggs from Walmart here. It's the, the brown cage-free organic eggs. And then I have Ezekiel bread. Ezekiel bread is a, it's really high in protein. It's a flourless bread. I'll have one of these. So two boiled eggs, one toasted Ezekiel bread. And this will give me 17 grams of protein, 17 grams of carbs, and 11 grams of fat. And that is how I will start my day. And so I just wanted to share that with you. I will put the description of these items on the bottom. And I will see you guys in the next clip. So friends, here is lunch. This is tofu and rice and beans. The tofu I made on the foreman. I actually I used uh, this tofu right here. Um, I just get this from Walmart. I drain it out and then I cut it. And this package is about four servings. So I'll cut it in fours and then take a block and cut that in three. And so that'll give me the serving that I want. So I made the tofu on the foreman and I sprinkled Mrs. Dash on it first and then cooked it. And then you can tell there's a little glaze to it. I'm not sure you could tell. I put a little orange sauce on it to give a little flavor. Cause as you know, with tofu, it will take on the flavor of what you add to it. And then this is jasmine rice, which is a little, it's not as firm as it normally is. I kind of put too much water in it. And that's about a cup, uh, half a cup, excuse me, of jasmine rice with rice um, with the beans. And then I added a fourth of a cup of beans just to make sure that I get um, the beans that I'm supposed to get. It's kind of hard to measure it when it's within the rice. Normally I use, I do use can, yes I do, use can, drain it, and then I normally puree it and then I'll add rice to it. Um, but this time I decided to be a little creative, go back to my Caribbean roots and just made them together. I'll put the description of these products on the bottom. And so, oh, and the orange sauce, my apologies. This is the orange sauce right here. I use half a serving because it is sweet and there is a lot of um, added additives in it that my coach would not be thrilled about, but nonetheless, Got to add a little flavor to the tofu. So I am going to eat this and then get back to the computer. One of the things I will share with you is the importance of stretching and rolling out with a foam roller. Um, my body is sore. And so I'm gonna take some time out to make sure I roll out those sore areas and also do some stretching. So hope you guys join me. <music>
lower half of me because like I said, I'm sore from the other day. So definitely incorporate stretching before and after your workout. Um, we neglect stretching and we wonder why our bodies hurt um, longer than it actually should. So definitely incorporate some of those stretches. And like I mentioned, that foam roller, I will put the description on the bottom. So it's time to work out. Let's see what we're